Hello viewers, I am Aitli. Today we are going to see 11 CBSE Max Complex Numbers and Quadratic Equation Miscellaneous Exercise Question Number 4. Let's see the question. If x minus i y equal to root of a minus i b by c minus i d then prove that x square plus y square the whole square is equal to a square plus b square by c square plus d square. We need to prove this. This is given. x minus i y is equal to root of a minus i b by c minus i d is given. We will take the given and we will go with the proof. Now given is x minus i y is equal to root of a minus i b by c minus i d. Here it is in root and it is in complex number. So I just going to take the I am going to do modulus both the sides. Usually we used to square both the sides. No, the same way now we are going to take modulus because we have a modulus z formula I'm go I can use that over here so I am taking modulus both the sides if I take modulus here it becomes x minus i y which is equal to I can write this to be a minus i b by c minus i d the whole power half because root we can write the root to be half so I am writing the root to be half over here now taking modulus Remember this if z power n we can also write this to be z modulus power n. So also modulus z is equal to root of a square plus b square. Here a square is the real part and b square is the imaginary part. Remember this formula I am going to apply this formula here. So modulus in modulus the half will come outside. Here I am going to use this formula over here. So this becomes root of x square plus yeah it is minus y so I can write this to be minus y the whole square which is equal to taking modulus separately and also the half outside it becomes a minus ib by modulus c minus id. You can bring this modulus separately. The as the square, if it is whole square, a by b the whole square, we can write this to be a square by b square. No, the same way we can write the modulus separately to the whole power half. Now we know that for modulus we have we can write in root. So this becomes x square plus y square. I am applying this formula over here modulus z equal to root of a square plus b square. I am going to apply this here so it becomes root of a square minus b square by the same way here root of c square my plus of minus d square the old power half. Now squaring both sides if I square both sides the root goes off if the root goes off it becomes x square plus y square here squaring both sides square and root get cancelled the same way this is also this is nothing but a root so root get cancelled here it becomes a square plus b square by c square plus d square root of so what we need to prove is this. Again I want to square because in the question to prove if you see the proof is here is x square plus y square the whole square. But what we got is x square plus y square. So again I am going to squaring this. So squaring both sides. Only then I can get x square plus y square the whole square. So square it again x square plus y square the whole square if i square to this side square and root get cancelled and becomes a square plus b square by c square plus d square this is what we need to prove we can write this to be hence prove so that's all with the sum thank you